Daily Devotion with Pastor Bala for September 27, 2020 from 2 Kings chapter 6. Ending a war without a fight. Verse 8. Once when the king of Syria was warring against Israel, he took counsel with his servants, saying, At such and such a place shall be my camp. But the man of God sent word to the king of Israel, Beware that you do not pass this place, for the Syrians are going down there. And the king of Israel sent to the place about which the man of God told him. Thus he used to warn him, so that he saved himself there more than once or twice. Nothing like having the all-knowing God to give you some inside information. Verse 11. And the mind of the king of Syria was greatly troubled because of this thing. And he called his servants and said to them, Will you not show me who of us is for the king of Israel? And one of his servants said, None, my lord, O king, but Elisha, the prophet who is in Israel, tells the king of Israel the words that you speak in your bedroom. So, the king of Israel goes after Elisha. Verse 15. When the servant of the man of God rose early in the morning and went out, behold, an army with horses and chariots was all around the city. And the servant said, Alas, my master, what shall we do? He said, Do not be afraid. For those who are with us are more than those who are with them. Verse 17. Then Elisha prayed and said, O Lord, please open his eyes that he may see. So the Lord opened the eyes of the young man and he saw. And behold, the mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire all around Elisha. And when the Syrians came down against him, Elisha prayed to the Lord and said, Please strike this people with blindness. So he struck, struck them with blindness in accordance with the prayer of Elisha. Verse 19, And Elisha said to them, This is not the way, and this is not the city. Follow me, and I will bring you to the man whom you seek. And he led them to Samaria right into the hands of the king of Israel. Verse 21. And as soon as the king of Israel saw them, he said to Elisha, My father, shall I strike them down? Shall I strike them down? He answered, You shall not strike them down. Would you strike down those whom you have taken captive with your sword and with your bow? Set bread and water before them, that they may eat and drink and go to their master. Verse 23, So he prepared for them a great feast. And when they had eaten and drunk, he sent them away. And they went to their master. And the Syrians did not come again on raids into the land of Israel. Wow, I wish this would happen all the time whenever a nation seeks to go to war with another nation. But this was God's handiwork. And as Jesus said in Luke chapter 6, verse 27, But I say to you who hear, love your enemies, do good to those who hate you. Jesus wants us to show love and concern even for our enemies. And this war was averted from any bloodshed because of the work and intervention of God working through Elisha. Join me again tomorrow as we have a special edition of the Daily Devotions, the special confirmation edition. God's peace and many blessings be with you. Thank you for watching and please take an opportunity to share this video with others. If you have enjoyed these daily devotions, please consider making a donation to Peace Lutheran Church, 24024 West Main Street, Plainfield, Illinois, 60544. Thank you again for watching.